All right, well, this is where we're staying. So let's uh, give you the entrance here. Call your Seminole State Park down here in the glades. When you first come in here and you get past the uh, shack here, you got the uh, the dredge here, which uh, dredged the entire uh, US 41 across from Naples to, uh, to Miami back in uh, 1921. So make sure you visit this thing when you come down here. There's a little greeting sign here also, uh, letting you know that you're not only in the Gravel Everglades, but you're in the Big Cypress Swamp. All right, now, we got one of two selections here. You got the picnic area, boat ramp, and nature trail to the left, and the camping area and the interpretive center to the right. All right, uh, we've already been to the camping area, yeah. so we're gonna go this way. All right, come down here. We got the Baron Collar Memorial down here, and uh, some other sites down here. It looks like so. Um, oh, this is where the trail came out from the visitor center. Okay, now I get it. All right, well, we're going to turn around right here, <clears throat> and we're going to head still back down here, and. Uh, this goes down to the water. There's a canoe kayak launch, uh, apparently, back down here. There's some other uh, things back here. What we'll do is we'll come out here after dinner and we'll do a walkthrough of uh, as much as we can here. Uh, some squirrels. This is a uh, first day down here and uh, people have run across uh, well few and far in between first of all but a couple people ran across uh, extremely extremely polite people down here so that's nice all right so here's the uh, here's the canoe launch area. Keep the canoes down here. And uh, oh, I didn't realize that. Apparently there's uh, manatees back in here also. Huh. I never would have thought of that. That's very interesting. I would have thought uh, that gators or manatees would not be around gators. Interesting. There's a uh, saltwater marsh area. And this, uh, this trail somehow wraps around all the way um, back where we were earlier. Back where we were earlier on the other side of Tamiami Trail, there's a gate, so it'd be on the north side. Um, 
and it's the starting of the of the uh, nature trail. And somehow it comes all the way out around I don't know somewhere back in here somewhere. This has service vehicles only, but it supposedly comes out back here somewhere. And it's a it's like about a six mile something like that loop. So we're gonna uh, we got a busy day tomorrow. We got the airboat scheduled tomorrow, and we got. Uh, Boat. Gotta go meet uh, Trader Jack again, again and uh, see if we can't uh, hand handle a gator. And then, uh, and then uh, I don't know, there's the rest by here, but oh, and then do the trail, be a big loop, big uh, loop. So, um, You can see, as you can see, you got plenty of uh, plenty of spots for here for biking. There's a little playground here. I mean, for parking. Excuse me. There's a playground here, and uh, another fine Florida park for you. Uh, I think there's another trail there. There's little trails all over the place. You know, the problem is you go in on them. Oops, sorry. You go in on them, but you don't know. Uh, you go back, and it turns out to be nothing. You know. But I don't think you're gonna have a whole lot of that down here. So. Well, this is road into the boat ramp, picnic area, new kayak launch, and there's another and it's, it's a small nature trail, which we're going to come out here after dinner and take a walk through that and these uh, exhibits out here. So right now we're going to head back on the road and we're going to head back to uh, the camping area. Here to the visitor center that we started at earlier. <coughs> and back into the campsite. So we're going to end it here. See you in the next one.